All right. Lico 3 here. Um, I just got back from uh, dinner and picked these two packages up earlier today. Um, it's a Friday, 16th. And let's see, I'll open this one first. It's the stuff I bought off eBay. Um, let's see what I got real quick. Oh, wow. This was a uh, two separate options and the uh, first card, it's on top of the graded card, but it's a uh, 2001 Breeze Pacific. And I bought this on eBay. Um, a little under 50 bucks, so I mean, that's a pretty good price for this card. Get a condition real quick. It's in reasonable shape. Looks mint to me. That's cool. I'm peeling the tape off the front to get to the back card. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, this was. Looks pretty good condition. This was 205 bucks, I believe. And it's got three colors. Um, Looks perfect to me, but who knows with Beckett? I actually don't want to get into the Beckett thing right now, but I had a uh, card come back that was damaged that Beckett had damaged a three hundred dollar card. I'll be doing a video here next couple days on it um, to show you what happened and the customer service. I'll get into that on a different video, but let's just do these cards first. Yeah. So that's a really nice card. Let's see, this is I'm pretty sure what this one is. It's one of the most expensive cards I've ever bought. It's from uh, Lou in Omaha. $19 shipping, you know it's pretty expensive. Oh wow. Wow. <laughs> this is a 2007 exquisite collection Adrian Peterson three color rookie. I've been looking to get this card for three years now. And this patch is nice and this is a very sensitive set and this one looks <laughs> almost flawless with a perfect Well, let's look at the condition of this thing. Yeah, it's definitely mint. I don't know if I'll send this in, but very nice card. Finally tracked it down. That is a three color exquisite. So that's it for today's mail day. Um, that was a fifteen hundred dollar card. I overpaid a little, but. The seller promised a good condition card and he didn't lie, so join me for the next mail day. Thanks. Um just wanted to talk a little bit more about this card. There's actually fakes of this that have been uh circulating on eBay. People have cut out a Viking patch or something and insert it into the card and try to make an extra buck, but all that tampering of cards is getting pretty old. This one looks authentic. Um, probably go off to PSA. I can barely see any, any white on the back of this one. That's the back. So. Looks like a nine to me. It's almost flawless, but okay. That's it for today's mail day. I have some new videos coming out here, so if you like the video, subscribe. 
if you have questions, you can email me um, at, uh, I'll just post it on my uh, channel, so tune in for the next one. Thanks.